I'm Henry Mandel. I'm from New York. Uh, I have a studio practice based there. I'm a contemporary artist uh, working in new media. Well, the painting is called Tatara Fire, and um, it's an allegory painting. It tells stories. On one level, it's a visual story because abstract painting is a visual language. On another level, it actually is language because all of the colored lines and shapes that are in the painting are the outlines of individual letters taken from text. When I start a piece, I do research online about a subject I'm interested in. In this case, it was transformation through fire. Um, and then I download the text. Uh, a tatara is a traditional Japanese kiln where they make a, a special kind of steel used in the creation of samurai swords. They mixed iron and charcoal and when they saw that it was at a particular color, this magical transformation had happened and they ended up turning them into these fearsome weapons of war. Uh, so I have all that text layered in there. And on top of that, there are also the names, locations, and histories of many of the cultural centers around the city of Columbia that were burned at the end of the Civil War, starting on the night of February the 17th, 1865. So there's a lot going on with the painting. You don't necessarily need to know all this stuff to appreciate it. It has to work as an experience of art first. But if you could take the process of how I made the piece and run it backwards, all of these tangled lines would untangle themselves and turn back into 10,000 words of legible text.